Greetings, everyone. Welcome to CCTV This Week. I'm Tom Phillips, the Executive Director of the Citrus Connection. And I just wanted to give you a report. Just came out of the board meeting. Uh, we had some live streaming issues this week. So since you all are in the know, I wanted to make sure that we communicated with you some exciting goings on. Uh, our budget. Uh, was presented to the board. It is a preliminary budget, but I'm excited to say that our budget for uh, the Citrus Connection side of the house is just under $11 million, and it does include the salary increases for uh, the union members. You can find that in your TWU 525 contract for how many years you've been at the district. Find yourself in that matrix, and obviously you know what to expect. For non-bargaining unit members, we do have a placeholder in the budget currently of the 2.25% uh, that the board has continued to do year after year. We're very thankful for them for that. Uh, it really does uh, add up year after year, so we're thankful for that. Also wanted to let you know that health insurance will continue to be free for the employees. Uh, that is for bargaining and non-bargaining unit employees, and we're still providing the same Cadillac coverage that you've enjoyed. Also wanted to let you know that we continue to be able to provide dependent care coverage, and the district is picking up 70% uh, of that dependent care coverage, and we'll continue to do that for the current fiscal year. Many employers uh, do offer family insurance, as many of you know, but it is very, very rare to find an a employer that covers any of the dependent care coverage, let alone 70% of dependent care coverage. So if you have a family, please take a look at that. Uh, as a reminder, there is a, a suite of Aflac products that you can also add. There are no new programs or routes in uh, the budget this year uh, for the Citrus Connection side of the house, or I'm sorry, the Lakeland side of the house. On the county side of the house, we will be adding two new routes. The Loffman route, which you can see on the screen here in a few moments, that will start off at Posner Park and enter into the Four Corners area, uh, serving the Loffman area. And then we are adding a 27 route uh, that will alleviate congestion on 27. This was a direct request from a uh, East Ridge Mayor's Group, and we were able to accommodate that and thank our partners at uh, the Polk County Board of County Commissioners for that. In other news at the board today, you may have heard there was a lively discussion about our pension liability. Uh, the liability is a long-term liability that the district carries and just wanted to make sure that all of you knew that, that all of you in the Florida retirement system, all of your contributions are being made to the Florida retirement system, so you should have no concerns about that. This is uh, a disagreement about a long-term liability, but if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to see finance. Uh, we also authorized the purchase of new Arbok buses, so continuing to have new vehicles roll into the fleet. Very excited about that. They'll have the avail system on there uh, and so those will be ready to hit the road shortly. Many of you know that we have a vehicle replacement program that allows us to buy vehicles year after year. This has not always been the case so we're always excited about purchasing new vehicles. We want to have the Google or uh, YouTube live streaming issues fixed for the next board meeting. Uh, we love that you all watch. The feedback has been that many of you do uh, while doing your other duties so we thank you for that. Uh, an informed team member is a team member that can contribute and really leads to our open door policy so you know all that's going on even at the board level. Be safe, Thankful. thanks for all that you do, happy back to school, and safe travels.